Dude, this game is fire. Gotta watch the trailer. It looks amazing. Dude, dude. Alright, I'm gonna just stop it there. But you gotta check this trailer out. So, welcome to my little reactions. Well, I would say live reactions. I'm just gonna watch the trailer back. It's only four minutes, but it's a. Uh, four minutes of awesomeness you guys got to check it out i'm going to link you guys to the trailer and link you guys also to the avulite channel and uh the plan was well from what i've heard is um they have some uploading issues so it's out it's out now that we got the trailer but the kickstarter what i guys can tell you right now the kickstarter is coming soon so um i'm just going to keep those details with the current details of the the information of the tiers in the description just like i mentioned the other day so you guys stay up to date and if anything changes i'll be back with probably either another video and just like i did from before i'll make those unnecessary changes because it's not euros it's into pounds the currency is pounds for the the tiers of which you choose to pledge. Now it's up to you, just like I said, it's optional. But I gotta just run you guys through this whole trailer. And to be honest, just to start from the beginning, what did I get from watching this? I'm gonna name multiple games here. I got Mario Kart vibes mixed with Crash Team Racing with the go karting mechanic right off the bat. And those graphics look really cool. Not even just games like Crash Team Racing from the the go karting mini game that you get to see in this trailer. This this fighting game that I played that was free for PlayStation Plus. Called called Absolver, and then some of you guys probably already play this and probably still to this very day this other game called for honor and then this game a blast from the past super monkey ball for from what i watch from the trailer when you move you see the avatar just rolling around in like a little bubble around different platforms and stuff like that it looks amazing so i'm just going to start from the beginning of course you guys are not going to be able to see it because i don't want to show it but i just i like that beat that was just pretty cool do 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 Every life is amazing. Everybody's talking about it. Dun, dun. That song is just going to be in my head. But just looking at the beginning, just to play and just watching it, re watching it right off the bat. It's showcasing the beach. The first video that they ever show from the pre alpha, the colors, the water looks amazing. The palm trees, everything looks so realistic. And why is it running? And why does it look this good? Because it's being ran on the Unreal Engine which is an amazing move and a good idea to, for your game to get it started to just for a graphics engine like that. That's just a, a, some of the games of today's games in today's day and age that's being ran on it. So it looks so just, you get a shot, you get your first look within about a minute within the trailer, you get a shot of the, just uh, the subway, the pre-alpha, and then that other space, uh, a little bit of the, the work in progress images that they showcase. And if you're watching about like one, about a minute and five seconds, you're going to, it does that. Does that not remind you of For Honor? When you see this guy's fighting one-on-one -on -one in a, a sword fight, it's like one, a one-on-one -on -one duel in For Honor. It, it just plays like that. And that's what I got from just watching just the first portion in the, the first minute. And he takes him down. And then the next point, as the, the trailer plays on, you're riding in the, you see the avatar riding in the go-kart. And then, immediately followed after that, the guy's throwing kicks and doing judo karate moves and all that stuff. It looks amazing. That's what, that's why I'm thinking about Absolver. Just when I played that game for the first time from last year, that's, it does, it is, it gives you so many different vibes. So not even just those homey vibes, but just a variety of games. And what I like from what I've seen from the trailer, just rewatching it, it, you got all those different vibes of games that you play. Some of the games that you grew up playing in those different mini games that you'll be able to dive in when you get a chance. Now, my, I'm just so curious, and just within like two minutes right now, only two minutes in with the trailer, just rewatching it in the background. I wonder if you're going to be able to get these different activities. You're going to be able to take a look at the, get a preview of the 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 decorations the the avatar customizations and then another game i have to throw out there within about two minutes and two minutes two and a half minutes going into the trailer video you're gonna does that not make you think of grand theft auto or just his suit and just with his, his suit that he had on it made me think about dead space it looks amazing you just gotta check this out so I'm just re-watching the, the trailer just to show you guys and talk about what is the trailer showcase and what you guys are going to be able to see. You see, you get all those different, you get a taste of everything that they show from the pictures that they show from work in progress, from all the spaces that they're going to be implementing in the game, just the graphics, the gameplay, the graphics, avatar customizations as well. 
And when I'm watching, as I watch it, I'm thinking about Super Monkey Ball. I'm thinking about other games that I was like the Crash Rafa Cortez stage with this bow. That's what, what it also makes me think of three minutes and 20 seconds in. And that's what made me think about Super Monkey Ball, all those different games. So and as you watch this, you're going to be able to see what it's like. And if you're watching this for the first time, you're, you're going to get excited for this game. If you love playing these type of these social games, avatar customizations that you get to be able to see different clothes, different outfits and different choices that you'll be able to pick and choose for your character, for which, how you want your avatar to look. You can make them look how you want them to be. And then, of course, if you want to get certain outfits, you can get those on the shops. I'm sure they're going to have that showcase sooner or later. But then going towards the end, just to wrap up the little trailer, they said Kickstarter. It says Kickstarter is coming soon. The link's in the description of the video. So just like I said, I'm going to link you guys to the channel. And then I will also share the trailer, the channel, well, the the Avalife Kickstarter trailer video so you guys can watch what I've just seen. Four minutes of amazingness, four minutes of a glimpse, a taste of what the game is going to be like. Something that you can really get into. And if you love PlayStation Home, I know you're probably going to be excited for this, especially if you play PlayStation Home a little bit. No matter how long, how long you've been playing it, maybe you recently started playing these games and it looks cool. Cool enough, you'll definitely want to play and check it out and head, head over there going towards the end of this video or into the link in the description to find out more about what this trailer showcases and just to take a look at the gameplay this looks but it's killing every social game i gotta just say it just to admit it i'm just blown away and i was so excited once i heard about the trailer coming out tonight so here it is so um i'm gonna keep an eye out for the the kickstarter information for you guys to see if it makes sure nothing has changed but just like i did from my video from yesterday i'm just gonna copy all the, the current information from the kickstarter info into the link into the description of this video as well so if you guys want to support this game and you choose to do and whatever you choose to, no matter how much you want to pledge or whatever, it's, it's, it's completely up to you guys. If you like this game, if you like games like this, it's lagging right now. But if you like games like this, just being a socialized and stuff like that, this is going to be the next best modern social game to get into. The next best virtual game I think everyone's going to be able to play. It's not just here on PlayStation 4 that I'm playing on. If you play on Xbox or PC, you can play it too, and you'll be able to experience it completely free when the game comes out. So that's going to be it. But uh, I'm going to send you guys the link and see you guys off to the trailer. But I just had to react to it and just talk about it just to see, just to watch it all over again. But that song. Dun, 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 dun. I love that. Dun, 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 dun. But I, I can't wait for, for this game to come out. I definitely want to play the beta now. I'm ready to play the game. I want to play the game right now. I want to play it this weekend whenever it becomes available. But whenever you guys get a chance, make sure you check it out. Check out the links and the uh, Kickstarter information in the, in the link in the description, and I'll have it pop up. It should be probably popping up by now if you guys can't see it on the video to the link to their main channel. And then also, it's going to be a link to their, their new Kickstarter trailer that's out live right now. Gotta check it out.